Hey guys, sorry I've been a little bit absent recently. Um, I really don't have an excuse because it's summertime, but yeah, stuff comes up. Anyways, today, uh, where I live, there's supposed to be like a tropical storm coming through, Bonnie. Um, I don't really know what the dealio is. I know there's really heavy, like really heavy rain this morning when I woke up and like thunder and stuff, but yeah, so I don't really know, so kind of stuck home all day, don't know when this thing's going to pass, so I just thought I'd do some videos. So what I'm going to be doing today, as you can probably see from the title, is my Better Than OPI video. Yep, I said it, and I'm not apologizing. Better than OPI. Um, for those of you who don't know, which I think most people do, OPI looks like this, and it's a brand of nail polish. Um, I guess it's kind of like the cool brand to have, um, but they're very expensive. They're $8 for a bottle. Um, and they're really cute. They have such cute names. Um, they come out with collections kind of like MAC um, that circulate through. They had an Alice in Wonderland collection. They sort of go with like what's in the media. Um, they've had Hong Kong collection, Spain collection, France collection, I think. Um, so basically all these different countries. And yeah, just kind of like cool type OPI nail polish. At least that's what I thought. So I actually have four. Um, this is the first one I got, and this is Russian Navy which is a very, very popular color. Um, this is just the plain one. Um, and I bought this because I'd seen it in Seventeen magazine. They mentioned it, and I thought, oh, navy nails, it's so cool. So I went out and bought it, and I was with someone, and as we walked out of the store where I bought this, they said, congratulations, Olivia, you've just wasted $8. Um, and I was like, no, no, I'll use it, I swear, I swear. Um, and I have. But, yeah, more on that later. Then, for my birthday, I got this one, which is from the Spain collection, España. And this is called Manicures of Seville. And it's just a red. And then, for Christmas, from somebody, I got two more. And these are from the matte collection, so they dry matte on your nails. And this is Russian Navy matte. So this is Russian Navy original, and this is the matte version. And then I got gargantuan green grape met, and it's a green. Okay, so these are $8 each, roughly. So that means that altogether, the four of these were $32. Um, that's a lot of money, let's just say. <laughs> and um, there are some really good things about these. The brush is huge. Like, they're notorious for having a really, really big brush. I don't know if I can show you. But yeah, the brush is, like, really big, and even though it doesn't really show it there, um, it sort of, like, flattens out onto your nail, so you don't need that many swipes. But, for the price, they're not that special. I mean, I get they come in a bunch of colors, but they chip easily. I don't find them very, like, good staying power on your fingers, especially, like, I always paint my nail my toenails this color, and it stays on for a long time, but on my fingernails, it lasts, like, a day before it chips. Um, it's not fast drying, it just, it's just average. Um, granted the bottle's pretty big and the names are really cute, like, there's one and it's a teal and it's called Teal the Cows Come Home, like, they're just really cute names. But, there are some nail polish I found that are better than OPI for less money. So, the first one I'm going to talk about is the Rimmel London 60 Seconds nail polish. And this one is in the color 615 Night Before. And this is everything I wanted Russian Navy to be. Um, Russian Navy is just sort of, it looks in the bottle kind of purpley, like it's got purple undertones, but in real life, like on my nail, I don't really see that that much. Whereas this one, as you can see, has got a lot more purple undertones and kind of like a goldy look to it. It's really, really nice. And it really does dry in 60 seconds, which is something I need, because I will not be able to sit still to for this to dry, so I'll constantly like nick it or smudge it or whatnot. But this is perfect, and it's got a quick and precise precision brush, as you can see it says on there. And basically, the brush is big, just like this one, so it covers your whole nail in one swipe. So definitely look out for these. They have a bunch of different colors, really pretty. And night before, get this instead of Russian Navy, please. I'm begging you. And I think this was about $4. Like, it's not that expensive at CVS or Walmart or wherever. Okay. Then the next two, I already did a review on way back. So scroll back in my videos if you want to hear more about these. 
But these are the Ulta Salon Formula Nail Liqueurs. And this one is in Gold Tipped Rose. And this one is in Apricot Sorbet. And they, these ones will stay on your nails for a while. Like, they don't chip on your fingers. They're just really, really pretty colors. Um, and yeah, they're only like $3. And I think they do specials sometimes where it's like 2 for $3 or things like that at Ulta. So check these out. Also, watch my review. It's a product rave, so just scroll back. Then the last one I want to talk about, sorry, you can probably hear my dog in the background. Um, the last ones I want to talk about are, I think they're UK exclusive. I don't think you can get them in the US, but if you can, please, please, please leave it in a comment where I can get them, because I'm obsessed. And they are the Berry M Nail Paints. And they come like this. And these were, um, they were Oh, what was it? I think it was like two for seven pounds. So that was like, no, maybe it was like two for seven dollars. I don't really remember, but it was cheaper than OPI. I do know that because I remember I worked it out. Um, but yeah, they were running a special at the boots that I went to. So I have this color, which is blueberry ice cream, and it's the one I have on my nails right now. So that's what it looks like. It's really, really pretty. Then I have mint green. Then I, which is just a mint green, and then I have mushroom, which is kind of like a taupey brown, but it's just, br it's kind of like a m muddy brown, but it looks really nice on. And then the last one's one of my favorites, and it's gray, and it's just a matte gray, and it looks like so chic and professional, I love it. Um, so yeah, I like, I'm blanking on the price right now, I'll probably put it down in the description. If not, just know it's around five dollars, I think, like I can't, literally cannot remember for the life of me. But, um... Yeah, I love, love, love these, and they are 10 milliliters, and the OPI ones are 15 milliliters, so the OPI one's slightly bigger, but with the Ulta ones, I forgot to mention this, this is 0.5 fluid ounces, and this is 0.5 fluid ounces, so this is the exact same amount as this, and this is like half the price, if that. Um, so yeah, definitely check out Barium Nail Paints. Ulta uh, Nail Liqueurs, and Rimmel 60 Seconds. They are definitely my favorites, and I'm going to say, yes, they are better than OPI. Um, also, please, if you know where I can get these, like, I'm obsessed. Another thing about the Barry M ones, like this, I painted my nails three days ago, and they're still perfect. And I'm not, like, easy on my nails. I dig in dirt, and it's all, like, my nails never last this long. So I'm really really happy with the staying power and it says keep away from heat apply base coat before use and I don't use a base coat or a top coat I just put this on and it's lasted me in the past it's lasted me about a week like perfect perfect so yeah um definitely check these out I think you can order them online if you are in the US and I actually I don't know I just made that up I think you can order them online I don't know if you can get them in the US but you can get them in the UK at Superdrug or Boots and if you're in the U.S. and you want these, make friends with an English person and ask them to send them to you because they're awesome, awesome. Um, so yeah, that's my little review, and I hope you found this helpful. If you have any nail polishes that you think are better than OPI, leave them down in the comments or in a video response. Love you guys. Bye.